Top of the morning to you guys, Sunday, day two of the weekend Ironman training. The corona hair is in full effect, the lettuce just needs to be chopped, it's, it's too long. So we're back in this crazy room, I know it's freaking mess, there's so much crap everywhere. Just look at it, just look at it. So today, hopefully we're gonna, you know, uh, declutter this room just a little bit. And sell one of the items that I left you with the cliffhanger on last night. So will it be the desks, the treadmill, the bikes? What will it be? Well, I'm gonna tell you boys, today we're gonna try to sell the treadmill on Facebook Marketplace. I know home gym equipment right now is going like gold on the Facebook Marketplace. My dad sold a weight set in like four hours. So hopefully we can sell this treadmill today, if not like in the, you know, coming few days and get rid of it so we can free up some space, but also make some change, you know, some cash on the way too. So first we must clean off everything so that we can take some pictures, post it on Facebook, and then we gotta go do workout number two of the Ironman training weekend. It's gonna be a brick workout. Swim, no, no swim. Bike and then run. Brick workout Sunday and we might be riding the new bus. Treadmill is cleaned off. Room's looking better in this corner already. Everything's on the desk now and this desk. We gotta clean off the desk. I think I'm gonna list it. I, I don't know what the value of this treadmill is. I got it for free. So I think I'm gonna list it for 300. And if someone wants for 300, gosh darn it, they can have it. It's been real Mr. Lifetime Fitness, but today you gone, baby, you gone. <laughs> We've had a very productive morning. So far this morning, I have vacuumed the entire house, Swiffered the entire house, listed the treadmill on Facebook Marketplace, had eight people comment that they want it, changed the pedals on my bike, so it's been a good morning. <laughs> good job. Woo We're earning the right to go out and ride, baby. Earning the right. Alrighty guys, fueling up before we set sail on workout number two for the weekend. We got a bike, we got to run, the good old fashioned brick workout. And I'm just gonna tell you now, it's gonna be an adventure boys. It's gonna be awesome. So let's eat, let's change, let's go out and let's freaking train, baby. Yeah. Awesome. This is like a whole new world to me right now and I'm loving it. Two main takeaways, you definitely go slower on the gravel and it's really windy. Also, you definitely gotta hold on and like pay attention or you're gonna take a digger because this gravel's a little loose, a little wet. I probably could have lowered my tire pressure a little bit. It would have been a little better, but this is awesome. Also boys, update on the treadmill. We had so many people asking to buy it. We have someone coming as soon as we're done riding to come pick it up. So it's gonna sell today, boys. Woo, it's gonna sell today. inaugural ride on the Niner. And I tell you what, that was the most fun I've had on the bike in a long time. No lies, that was awesome. <laughs> Gravel life is for me, baby. 32 miles, an hour and 52 minutes. It was super windy today, so we weren't going very fast. I averaged 230 watts for the, you know, the whole time, and I only averaged 17 miles an hour, so it was really windy. But now, we gotta finish the second part of, part of the workout. We got a 20 to 30 minute easy run. Still early in the season, you know, we don't have to be flying off the bike yet but we want to get the legs you know we want to teach them how it feels to run after riding a bike so i gotta change clothes gotta throw on the running gear we're at this big old high school i'm just gonna run some laps around the parking lot and then we gotta go home and sell a treadmill baby sorry it's windy out here time to hit the brick baby time to hit the brick
All right, man, weekend of training in the books, baby. In the books. It's a good feeling. We ran just about three miles at like a seven, let's see, 750 average. So, you know, just cruising. Weekend workouts in the books feels so good to just know that you're, you know, you did all the work you need to. And now you can just chill. So now we gotta go back and we gotta sell that gosh darn treadmill. Person's meeting us at four. It's like 315. We got like a 30 minute drive home. So we got a little bit of a rush. Well, let's go sell that treadmill. Get that thing out of there. Make some room for the bikes. Alrighty guys, treadmill is gone. Look at this. Woo! It's bare. The nice folks are outside right now loading it up. A couple of people drove up from South Carolina, came scooped up the treadmill. So literally five hours of Facebook Marketplace. That's all it took to sell the treadmill. Alrighty, me and Shafi are rolling around, going to get some dinner. But all in all, guys, I think this weekend was a massive, massive success. We got four and a half hours of training in. We got a new bike. We got rid of the treadmill to make room for the new bike. We cleaned the house. I mean, we did it all this weekend, guys. Great weekend overall. Really great time. Uh, I don't even know what I'm saying. I think I'm, I think I'm starting. But there it is. A full weekend of Ironman training. If you guys did enjoy the video, of course, please help support your boy and give it a thumbs up. It will help, you know, get these videos out to other people that uh, enjoy triathlon, enjoy good content, and just want to see, uh, you know, some interesting videos on the YouTube. I appreciate you guys watching. It really means a lot to me. And I'm having a lot of fun making the content, so it's, it's going to keep coming. I promise. With all that said, we'll see you guys in the next video. Chris Webster, Chris Fit. Over and out, baby. <laughs>